¿De quién te traes? <risa> el bobito. Me el bobito. <risa> so, I'm filming, ya, ya estoy grabando. Pero no me sale todo yo. Un momento, por favor. Es que padre. Hi. Hi, everybody. Hoy ya sabes hablar inglés. I'm in Sunday. I'm so excited. <laughs> Me too. This, this is my mom. If you don't know her, ¿por qué con los dedos? <laughs> oh, it's because she, she her no, oh, she's chipped. No, the rest is. Oh, because she washes dishes. So I'm gonna be doing makeup on my mama. Um, do something more natural, more youthful. Um. Because I do get asked, I do get asked about makeup for mature skin. Um, and I used to do that a lot when I worked at Bare Minerals. So hopefully some of you will find this helpful. But I mean, this look will look good on any age. So, para con tus, para verte. Okay, so let's get started. My mom brought her little makeup bag. So I'm gonna just take out some of the things that she normally uses. I'm using the Soap and Glory one heck of a blot, mainly just on her T-zone, but this is basically gonna be a step where you have to assess your skin type. My mom is more, I would say, normal. Normal to oily, because, uh, she is dealing with menopause, so she does overheat, and her T-zone area can get a little bit shiny looking throughout the day. Glossier Stretch Concealer. My mom's shade is medium. I'm going to be using this with a big brush. Now I'm applying the Stretch Concealer almost like foundation. Hers is really melted. Está derretido. Tu corrector. Porque ve cómo está. Never mind taking another brush because my Por brush. Calor? Taking a clean brush. And I'm just gonna start to blend. So my mom plays tennis, so she's outdoors quite a lot. But I have to cut Okay. She's outdoors quite a lot. And um, if she's not playing tennis, she's practicing tennis um, or she's outdoors with Bowie so that's why you see some of the sunspots and plus she's from a whole different generation not us that's that's on Instagram and YouTube all the time so SPF chemical exfoliator all that jazz really wasn't a thing back in her day so now she's having to you know repair all of that but um apart from that like your skin's pretty good. Okay, so we have the first layer of coverage. Although we did cover quite a lot, it's still quite a sheer layer, so you can still see some of the sunspots, but it's not super noticeable. And her skin still looks like skin. It still has that glow. It doesn't look heavy. It doesn't look cakey. For foundation, I'm going to be using the Bare Minerals Original Foundation in the shade Golden Medium. I got into Bare Minerals because of my mom. She was the one that used it way before I started using it. And I used to steal her medium beige back in the day, and then I got my own. <laughs> I'm using the Beautiful Finish Brush, which is the brush that is designed for the Original and the Matte Foundation. So with the Bare Minerals Foundations, swirl. Tap, buff. Don't be afraid to buff onto the skin because it looks more natural. You emulsify the minerals when you do that. Don't forget the neck a little bit. But that's basically it for the coverage. So it's still quite natural and more evened out. It doesn't look heavy. It doesn't look cakey. My mom's getting into it now. But uh, yeah, this is very simple. So this is what she normally does on a daily basis, but I'm just much more of a perfectionist. Now I'm going to bronze the skin. This is from the contour palette from Bare Minerals that they discontinued, but any matte bronzer will do. I'm going to be using this middle shade. I'm just going to start applying it almost like a, like a three. 
So the standard way of applying bronzer, but most of the color you want it right below the cheekbone. So this is just gonna add some warmth into your skin. But with bronzer, it's just adding a little bit of warmth. We're not contouring. For blush, I'm going to be using this guy from Tarte. This is the Fanciful blush. I don't even know if they sell that anymore. But once again, any type of blush will do. This is just what my mom has and hasn't used up completely like this guy. <laughs> so with blush, normally you, well, I've seen a lot of people smile. Sonríe. So when you smile, the cheeks are naturally a little bit higher, but when your face is relaxed, blah, 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 then it kind of seems to like drag down the face. So I like to keep the face completely relaxed and then you can go upwards just a little bit. So this creates more of a lifted effect and it'll look the same when your face is relaxed and when you're smiling. This is a tip that I learned from Wayne Goss. Wayne Goss is amazing and a YouTube OG. For the brows, Glossier Boy Brow, she uses the shade Black, which is my shade as well, when I don't have orange hair. So I'm just gonna comb through her brows. She also has quite full brows. I got it from my mama, for sure. Let me see if I can get that just a little for eyeshadows, this is her favorite palette. She already went through one of these and I gave her the spare one. So if you saw my decluttering eyeshadow video, uh, she got the spare one. So we're gonna be using this. This is mostly mattes, one shimmer. I know a lot of times with mature skin, they're afraid of shimmer, but I will be using some shimmer from my own collection just to show you that you can indeed use shimmer. You just gotta use it more stri strategically. There we go. Sometimes I struggle with big words, but you can definitely use shimmer. Glitter, I would say go for it if you really want to. Nice shadow primer. This one is from Elizabeth Mott, which I got in a birch box. Mom kept it. I'm gonna start with Foxy. These two colors, and these are going all over her eyelid. These two mixed together are basically her skin tone. So I'm just setting the primer and providing a base so everything blends out more evenly. Now taking Naked 2, which is the lighter brown, and this is gonna be going up in the crease. Abre tus ojos. So since her eyes are naturally now, as she's aged a little bit um, more hooded, I would say, when you keep your eyes open, you can see exactly where to place that eyeshadow in the crease. So that way when it's open, it doesn't get hidden in the actual crease. So I'm actually going up a little bit higher, a little bit above the crease. I'm just gonna keep blending, just keeping everything quite soft. Now I'm gonna take a little bit of faint, which is the darker brown, just a little bit, and I'm gonna place it just in the outer portion of the crease. Now I'm gonna take a shimmer and I'm actually gonna go in with this guy. This is a ColourPop eyeshadow. Cierra los ojos. And I'm gonna apply it right on to the center of the eyelid. So that way, even when you open, you still see a little bit. You can also apply shimmers just a little bit onto the inner corner. Now I'm gonna take a little bit of Naked and this guy, W-O-S, and I'm gonna just fill the, the lid up a little bit. Taking W-O-S and a little bit of Faint. Smaller brush, I'm gonna take the brown and a little bit of the black. And I'm gonna use that to line the eyes a little bit. I know my mom likes her liner, but sometimes she still goes a little bit 90s with her liner. So I'm just trying to create something softer that won't close her eye too much. 
Now I'm going to take a little bit of eyeliner. This is the Bare Minerals One Fine Line in the shade Black. And I'm going to just go really close to her eyelashes once again. My mom's going to curl her lashes and then apply some mascara. The mascara that she has, she has like four actually. <laughs> Some are dried up, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> but we have the Bare Minerals Love Every Lash Mascara, which is great. It's a water resistant formula. This one, which is the Glossier Lash Slick, is also water resistant formula. So these are good if you have hot flashes or just an oilier skin type, even at your age. So these two are great. This is the Buxom Big False Lash Mascara. And then we have this L'Oreal one. Esa no te gustó, ¿verdad? No me gustó el cepillo. She didn't like the brush, so we're not going to be using that one. I'm going to be applying the Glossy Lash Slick. And I like to fan the lashes, like, outside, like, outwards, just to create more of a wider eye effect. I have a piece of Mom <laughs> likes her red, so I'm going to do kind of a reddish lip. So this is MAC uh, Chicory, Chicory or Chicory, I don't even know, Chicory lip liner. And for mature skin, I recommend starting from the, oh, would this be the sides of the lips? <laughs> Sorry, not super technical. So I'm starting from over here and dragging upwards. Once again, to create a more lifted effect and you're not dragging the lip down. If you wanted to, you could overline just because as we age, we kind of lose that natural um, border on our lips. So I'm just going to lightly draw over the little like crease that she has. My mom hasn't tried these yet, but these are the Bare Minerals Bare Pro Lipsticks, which are a long wear lipstick that's super creamy. So I'm using the shade Geranium on her, which is almost like a, like a berry, like a red berry shade. You struggle to keep makeup on the whole day, you can use a setting spray. The ones that I recommend the most are the ones from Scandinavia or Urban Decay, though they're great as well. I don't have my Scandinavia one on me, so I'm going to be using this one by Black Radiance, which is the matte setting spray. So this is the finished look on my mom. Her skin looks radiant. It doesn't look kicky. It doesn't look heavy. Uh, we have a little bit of shimmer on the eye, so you definitely can wear shimmer, even if you're more mature. But yeah, it looks really nice. Muy pretty. So that's it for this video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Please make sure to subscribe if you're brand new and let me know if you want to see more makeup looks done on my mom because I can definitely do that. If maybe you want a night out makeup look. I don't know. Let me know in the comments below. Follow me on Instagram. She makes a lot of appearances on my Instagram. I'm like, I said it's mucho. Mucho. So... <laughs> Uh, me, my mom, and little Bowitos. Little Bowitos is. Uh, we're gonna go now. Thank yes. you guys so much for watching, yes. and we'll see you soon. Bye. 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 <laughs> Bye. <laughs>